Taking a look at your top story, former public administration and minister Nguako Ramaklori is in hot waters. Well, quite literally so, Ramaklori has been accused of torturing a Cameroonian citizen with boiling water after a business deal went wrong. He's accused of renting out his house without any contract. The victim, 43-year-old Joseph Menge, claims that he was attacked by the former minister's associates. A police case has been opened and Northwest police say a case of attempted murder is still under investigation. Investigation. Menge made the startling claims to well which could come as an embarrassment in an exclusive interview to the New Age. Let's now look at the allegations against the former minister. Former minister gives the Westlake country and safari estate hard pierced words in the northwest province on rent. Joseph Menge alleges that he was tortured and burnt by Ramaklodi and two associates. Menge say there was initially no agreement reached about how much rent he would be required to pay because Ramaklodi was too busy to discuss the matter. Later on July 18th, Ramaklodi demands 40,000 rand, which included a deposit and 20,000 rand monthly rent. Ramaklodi came with two men and one of them hit Menge with the back of his gun on his head near the ear. According to the victim, the men started beating him with an iron and frying pan. Menge also alleges that boiling water was poured on him. Menge was told that he would be a threat to the lions at the farm. Responding on behalf of Ramatlodi, his lawyer Lazarus Mbonyana Lidwaba says, and I quote, Our client is aware of the case. The matter is now in the hands of the authorities. Our client is cooperating fully with the authorities. From the outset, we must overemphasize the fact that our client vehemently denies the allegations against him, end quote.